Hello everyone watching this video. So in recent weeks, there are many people that reached out to me that when they update to newer MUI versions, they're unable to use the good old way of scrolling to the bottom and click the allow restricted settings when they wanted to allow the, the accessibility or notification restricted settings on their MIUI 14 edition they couldn't do that so and also there are a few people from from out of devices that there's absolutely zero option of doing this namely Techno and Infinix device and there are probably also other people that are using a custom ROM like me who just can't enables the option for some reason so this video will show you how to enable accessibility or notification restricted settings if the option is absolutely unavailable so before watching this video uh, I have to remind you that this guy will be rather complicated so you should you better search for other guys, simpler guys, before coming to me. And secondly, uh, you will have to uninstall the app that you wanted to grant the accessibility or or notification restricted setting. Uh, because well, you cannot just update the app to make it work. You will have to uninstall it and reinstall it again. So be sure to back up the, your app's data before proceeding. So for example here, I have again launcher. I open it up. This is a third party launcher. So for example, I want to, I want it to have a notification dot on the menu so I will try to change the settings launcher and now we will say the settings setting for your security this setting is currently unavailable the good old restrict setting menu so you go back to home you go to settings you go to you will search for the app for example here, launcher, app info. For example here, there's no three dot menu. There's no, there's no, there was no three dot menu or there's no allow the restricted setting switch at the bottom. bottom. So, so what am I going to do? So now you're going to do is that you will have to uninstall the launcher like I said in the beginning you have to uninstall it so be sure to back up any data you have to uninstall it okay uninstall it and then you will have to install the app with a Fire Explorer an APK installer or a third party app store that utilize the package installer section, the section installer, like here, like right here, this is a very comprehensive article that, that will give you a look at how this feature works, how this restricted setting, how this restricted setting mechanism works, and here it has a paragraph Android determines whether an app came from an app store during the installation process with an app with an accessibility service that uses session based package installing API the restriction does not apply and the user can enable the accessibility service so Google does allow you to install a third party APK without this annoying restricted settings window but you will have to use 
a session based packet installer API, which is usually used by third party app stores or file managers or an APK installer. Anything using this session package installing a installation API will work. So here what we are going to do. We are going to go to Google, search from Explorer, go to the link in here in XDA forums. I will provide a link to download this at the description. I have this stable version installed right here. But this also has the beta version which use which is a totally different app. So it can have the demo for you guys how to install the file explorer on and everything after that for the mixed beta. Go to the APK, download it. Probably maybe harmful. Download it anyway. So now it's downloaded, open it, install it. So install the Mix Explorer, open the app, agree with the privacy policy. Also, agree in the file access so you can read your files and install the APK. Allow it. It is now allowed. Go back to the app. Now, for example, here I have the launcher app. Right here, I will have I will reinstall it. Click on here. Click agree. Then if this window opens, go to just click install here. Do not click any of these options. Just click install here because the only this option we use the session based packet installer API. Click on install. Click on install. Enable install unknown apps from Turn it on Launcher and install Install the app And the app should be installed So I go back here Launcher I will have it into My main home screen So now you will have it set up from fresh again Go to home settings. Allow. So now if you want to, to agree the notification dot function. Change settings. Launch here. Boom. You have, you have it enabled. You have it enabled. Boom. It is now enabled. For example, now here I go. Boom, it is now enabled. For here, I will, and now I want to enable double tap to sleep, accessibility service. The option is not blanked out anymore. Turn it on. Now you can turn it on. Very well. So, there you have it. And then you have another note is that if your app have a future update, you will have to update with the same way that I've mentioned you above. If you don't update the app with the same way that I mentioned above, then if you dis and if you accidentally disable the accessibility service or the notification permission, the restricted setting window will appear again. So keep that in mind. And well, that's all the guy for you. Thanks for watching and goodbye.